Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I will be sharing with you how to make this amazing overnight high growth spray that you can add to your regimen in order for your hair to grow longer, healthier and thicker. And if you're interested, definitely be sure to keep on watching and watch to the end of the video so you don't miss out on any useful information. Now, if you're new here, I do appreciate you checking my channel out. So please click that subscribe button to join the family. And if you're returning, thank you so much for your support and let's hop right into today's video the first ingredient we're going to need for today's recipe will be some dry hibiscus leaves now I got mine from Amazon but feel free to check eBay as well or Amazon in your area um, or your country so hibiscus is very good for hair guys because it prevents baldness it treats dandruff and itchy scar it conditions the hair it also helps to stimulate hair growth now i'm also going to go in with some horse tail now horse tail is extremely beneficial as well guys because it helps to speed up the hair growth process it reduces dandruff it treats um, scalp conditions and it actually boosts scalp circulation as well so it increases the blood flow to your scalp area which in turn can help nourish your follicles and stimulate faster hair growth so I used about a tablespoon of that now I'm going in here with some neem powder so neem powder is really good because it helps to condition the scalp it promotes healthy hair growth reduces dandruff and essentially speeds up the hair growth process as well so definitely worth adding to your regimen so I'm going to use about a tablespoon of that as well and then I'm just going to combine those three ingredients together and then I'm going to pour in some hot water just so I can infuse this a little bit faster but if you want you can just apply um sort of pour in some cold water and just allow it to infuse for a longer period of time but this is much quicker um to do with um hot water so I'm just going to stir this and just allow it to sit around to infuse for about an hour or until the water has completely cooled down. So this is about an hour later. This is what it looks like. You can see the hibiscus has completely infused because the water is now pretty red, like bright red. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and strain this now. So I'm using my recap here to do this I suggest you do use a recap guys or a stocking cap for this because of the neem powder in it So if you are just to use a regular sieve um, You will probably have some neem powder left that I mean that will pass through the holes of the sieve So it's better to use something that's much finer So I'm just pouring that on there and then I'm going to go ahead and just lift the um the recap and just allow it to just drain i'm not going to squeeze anything because i really don't want to get the powder or the name powder into my spray so it's better that you just sort of do it this way it doesn't take long to do at all um so yeah So I was just showing you guys here what I have left behind. You can keep that and use as a mask if you want to. So I'm now going to go in with some vitamin E. Now vitamin E is extremely beneficial as well guys for our scalp. So it promotes a healthy scalp. It moisturizes your scalp. It nourishes it. Um, and it's just extremely beneficial in general. So I don't know how many of these that I've added guys. If you've got the actual vitamin E, like the actual oil, feel free to pour that in there. So I used quite a few of these uh, capsules because I did not have the, um, what's it called, like the actual oil. You know the one that you the one that I mean, like the one in the bottle. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and pour that in there pretty much. Now, if you haven't got vitamin or E oil, guys, please use any other oil of your choice. It could be uh, argan oil or perhaps just olive oil. So any oil that you've got available. Now, I'm going in here with my essential oils. I just love, love, love essential oils. And as I always say, guys, it's very beneficial for our hair because it helps to improve blood circulation around the scalp area, which in turn helps to promote faster hair growth. So I'm using peppermint essential oil here. 
and tea tree essential oil because it's got amazing antibacterial properties as well which does help with the overall scalp health so i added a few drops of that and then i'm going to go ahead and just stir until everything is nice and combined now i'm going to transfer that to my spray bottle so that it's easy for me to apply um, so this is your spray pretty much done now stick with me guys so I can show you how I apply this to my hair and to tell you a bit more about how to use it Okay guys, so this is the spray pretty much ready. So we're just ready to just apply this to our hair at this point. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm starting here on pretty much dry hair, but clean. Um, it's been maybe like a week or two since I washed my hair and moisturized it. So I'm just sort of, you know, using this just to moisturize my hair. But I would suggest that, you know, you use it as often as possible. So perhaps twice, to three times a week you can just use that to moisturize your hair as you go now i know somebody's going to ask me whether or not to wash this out i'll suggest that you don't guys so leave it in your hair because it will help with retaining moisture and also it will help to nourish your scalp and essentially help with you know growing your hair um so i'm just on doing every little sections of hair that i have here and i'm just going to spray this to my scalp to begin with and every time i spray to my scalp guys i will massage a little bit just to help distribute the um spray all over my hair around the roots area and also my scalp so spray that there and then i'm going to go ahead and also spray it to my ends and the rest of my hair now i'm using one of my diy oils here just to seal the moisture and also to oil my scalp so i'm just applying a bit of that to my scalp area and again massaging a bit and then i'm going ahead to do the same for the rest of my hair now i'm not going to go ahead and detangle because I already detangled my hair properly um, about two weeks ago so I'll, I try not to over manipulate now so essentially if I've already detangled my hair I try not to detangle again uh, until perhaps you know closer to wash day so I'm just gonna go ahead and just apply this but not physically go ahead and use a comb or a brush to detangle if anything i'll probably just use my fingers and run through it uh, um, to remove you know shed hair if i do have any and then i'll repeat that until the rest of my hair is completely done so it's a very nice simple easy routine that i believe that you know anyone can incorporate into their regimen because to be honest it's very quick and simple to make and um <clears throat> And very quick and simple to apply as well you don't have to necessarily I mean if you've got Conroe's on or mini twists or whatever protect style you're wearing you can literally just spray and go like spray oil and go now the good thing about hibiscus as well is that it helps with premature grain so if your hair is nice and dark now guys you need to start using this so it doesn't actually end up you know getting gray like mine um not that i mind my grays but i'm just sort of saying that it does help with premature graying which is absolutely uh, amazing as well Now, if you've made it to this point of the video guys and you're not yet subscribed please please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and also your notification bell so you know next time I post a new video the other day I was actually looking at my YouTube analytics and it's funny because like 90% of the people watching me are not subscribed um, so I mean what are you waiting for you know you've been watching my videos over and over again that means you probably find them helpful or interesting in some way so please click that subscribe button and and basically join the family and also guys give the video a thumbs up if it's something that you enjoy watching or perhaps if you like the spray and you think you might you know end up making it 
definitely give the video a thumbs up and also share with that friend that family member you believe could benefit from it uh, because you know you don't want to keep it to yourself do you um so yeah so essentially i'm just sort of repeating the exact same thing here i'm going to do that throughout my whole hair i was literally like showing you guys how long my hair is like i feel like my hair has grown i don't know if it's just me or I don't know I'm, I'm i may be wrong let me know in the comment section down below guys do you think my hair has grown i think it's grown quite a lot um but yeah i don't know um so yeah this is sort of pretty much it for me today guys unfortunately i won't be able to you know show you how i do my entire hair because otherwise the video will be extremely long as you can imagine so i'm just sort of showing you guys how i'm applying this but i'm going to finish it off camera so this is it for me today thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed the video as always like i always say guys give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're not already leave me a comment as well i do read them all and i'll catch you in my next video which will be very soon thank you so much bye